you are listening to the voice of the gospel a proclamation of the holy gospel by wisdom ministries december 23rd wednesday let's begin this day with the blessings of god a reading from the holy gospel according to saint luke chapter 1 verses 57 to 66 now the time came for elizabeth to give birth and she bore a son her neighbors and relatives heard that the lord had shown his great mercy to her and they rejoiced with her on the eighth day they came to circumcise the child and they were going to name him zachariah after his father but his mother said no he is to be called john they said to her none of your relatives has this name then they began mourning to his father to find out what name he wanted to give him he asked for a writing tablet and wrote his name is john and all of them amazed immediately his mouth was opened and his tongue freed and he began to speak praising god fear came over all their neighbors and all these things were talked about throughout the entire hill country of judea all who heard them pondered them and said what then will this child become for indeed the hand of the lord was with him the gospel of the lord praise you lord jesus christ dear friends as we approach the day of jesus birth the gospel today speaks of the birth of john the baptist it is a day of a particular joy for elizabeth as her shame is wiped out she can now stand tall in the presence of her family and neighbors her neighbors and the kinsfolk heard that the lord had shown great mercy to her and they rejoiced with her in accordance with the custom the boy is to be circumcised on the eighth day and a name given to him everyone presumes he will be given the name of his father but elizabeth says his name is to be john people protested there is no one in your family with that name zachariah the father is consulted since this dialogue with the angel he cannot speak so he is given a tablet on which he wrote simply he states his name is john and with that his tongue was loosed and he could speak and praise god the incident became the talk of the whole district and people began to ask each other what then will this child be they knew that these unusual happenings all pointed to a special calling for the child the circumstances of the birth the circumcision of the child emphasizes john's incorporation into the people of israel we will find the same same emphasizes with the jesus look so that those who play crucial roles in the inauguration of christianity to be wholly a part of the people of israel at the end of the acts of the apostles we can find he will argue that christianity is the direct descendant of the pharisaic judaism we can ask the same question about ourselves what then i am i called to be no matter what age i am there is still life ahead of me be it long or short what's my destiny what does god want me to do what contributions can i make to the other people's lives god has expectations of me based on the gifts he has given to me let me reflect on what they might be and how can i make good use of them amen may god bless us